Will you be surprised if I tell you that once you learn today's concept, you will be able to do additions in under 10 seconds. Today we will learn about the drop 10 method of addition in Vedic math. Since it makes adding a list of numbers super easy and fast, it is also called the long number addition. As I stated before, the drop 10 method helps in quick addition of large sets of numbers. In the examples, you will see red dots. These dots represent 10. We are going to solve this example step by step so that you feel absolutely comfortable with the concept. Here we have a bunch of numbers which we need to add. We have the ones or unit side and ten side. We will start adding from the bottom digit on the one side. We will keep adding one digit at a time until they add up to 10. At that point, we will stop and put a dot for 10. Here 7 plus 3 is equal to 10. So we will put a dot above 3 for 10 and continue adding. Next, when we add 5 and 7, we get 12. Again, we will stop here as we have reached 10. We will add a dot above 7 for the 10. So now we are left with carry over 2. For the next addition up to 10, we will start with a carry over 2 and add it to the rest of the digits. So 2 plus 1 plus 2 is equal to 5. Since there are no more digits to add, we will write the final digit 5 from the one side in the answer section. Next, we will take care of the dots in the one section. Since there are two dots, we will write 2 at the bottom of the 10 section. We will continue adding in the 10 section. Starting from the bottom, 2 plus 8 is equal to 10. So we will put a dot above 8 for the 10. Let's keep adding. 6 plus 2 plus 3 is equal to 11. So we will put a dot above 3 and carry over 1 from 11. Moving on, carry over 1 plus 1 plus 4 is equal to 6. Now since we do not have any more digits to add, we will write 6 in the tenths answer section. Next, we will count the number of dots. Since here there are 2 dots, we will write 2 in the answer section. So the final answer is 265. Now that you are clear with the basic concept, let's go through one more example. We will start from the bottom digit on the one side. 1 plus 2 plus 7 is equal to 10. So we put a dot above 7 and keep adding. 4 plus 3 plus 2 is equal to 9. Since there is nothing else to add, we will write 9 in the answer section. Next, we will count the number of dots. We have one dot, so we will write 1 at the bottom of the next section. Moving on to the 10th side, we will start adding from the bottom up. 1 plus 7 plus 4 is equal to 12. Next, we will put a dot for 10 and carry over 2 from 12. Moving on, carry over 2 plus 5 plus 8 is equal to 15. So we will put a dot for 10 and carry over 5. Next, 5 plus 2 plus 4 is equal to 11. So we will again put a dot for 10 and write the carry over 1 from 11 in the answer section. Lastly, we will count the number of dots in the 10th section. Here there are 3 dots. So we will write 3 in the answer section. Our final answer is 319. This addition trick is applicable for any number of digits. Add till 10, put a dot and continue adding with carryover if any. Write the last digit in the answer section. Next, count the number of dots and write them at the bottom of the next line. Then just repeat the same steps to get the final answer. Here we have three questions in the practice quiz. Please pause the video and try to solve them mentally. The answer and explanation is given after each question. Quiz 1. Add these digits using drop 10 method. You can choose your answer from the following options. Here's the answer and explanation for quiz 1. Quiz 2. Add these numbers using drop 10 method and choose your answer from these options. Here's the answer and explanation for quiz 2. Quiz 3. Find the answer for the following addition. This is the answer and explanation for quiz 3. 
we will end today's chapter with a quotation by Epictetus. It is not what happens to you, but how you react to it that matters. Thank you and take care.